Welcome back, everybody, to Portal 2. This is going to be part 3. Uh, I'm trying to remember where I was. I kind of stood here for a second. I think what we've done is we've met, we finally passed most of the, like, crazy part of Gladys trying to murder us in the dark. I don't remember where Wheatley is. I feel very confused. It's been about a week since I played. Um, I've been working a lot, unfortunately. Uh, I work at a, a warehouse, so uh, right now with holidays and everything coming up, it's the it's the busy time of year for us. So I do apologize Turret for that. Redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. Mm. It doesn't sound super good. I don't love that. Okay. I am assuming that I should use a portal here. Be there. I might die. I might die. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Please exit the turret redemption line. Hmm. I don't want to. No. Can I jump on this? Ah, I can. Cool. Okay. Will I die? Potentially. Ooh. That's why I don't do platformers. You're different. Thank you. Get mad. Get mad. Don't like lemonade. You don't like lemonade. Are you mad? Lemonade was punished by the gods for giving the gift of knowledge to man. He was cast into the bowels of the air and picked by birds. That sounds comforting. It won't be Do I go down? The answer is beneath us. The answer is beneath us. Her name is Carolyn. Thank you. Whose name is Carolyn? And which way do I go? I Carolyn? That's all I can say. Okay, well I'm gonna set you down right there. I think. Okay. Well, bye, buddy. You know, maybe I'll just. Can... Oh no! Oh, he landed on a blackness. Oh well. Well, I was gonna bring him with us, but oh well. Doesn't look like that. He's gonna. Target acquired. Target acquired. Stand up. Shooting blanks every time. All the time. <laughs> what? Shooting blanks. No can do. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. So, what am I, uh, supposed to do here? Oh, get out of here, get out of here. Yeah, more than that. <laughs> Me at work every day. Response. Play me. Aww. Response. Can I catch this? Template. Response. Play me catch. Oh my god! Oh. I I dropped him. Template. Response. Come on. I can't say anything. Just happened. Better open the box. Response. 
Well, I couldn't bring the other one with me, so this guy gets to go with me. Oh, brilliant! You made it through. Well done. Follow me. You're gonna love this. I guess I probably don't need him, huh? Almost there. Okay. Ta da! Only the turret control center. Thank you very oh, much. Oh, wow. See that scanner out there? Yeah. It's deciding which turrets to keep and which Tumblr. to toss. And it's using Response. that master turret there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template turret, Tumblr. it'll shut down the whole production Response. line. Right. Um, hmm. I'm going to have to hack the door Tumblr. so that we can get at it. Response. Technical. Um, you'll need to turn around while I do this. Fine. I won't look. Okay, go on. Just pull that turret out. I'm gonna put this one in its place. Okay. Fine then. Well, that should do it. Template missing. Continuing from memory. Oh, it hasn't done it. What, what, what do you have there? Ow. Yeah, let's do it. What, what are you? Oh, brilliant! It's put, that's brilliant! <laughs> If we're lucky, she won't find out all her turrets are crap until it's too late. <laughs> okay, just keep your eye on the turret line. I'm going to go and hack the door open. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. Okay. It's a little bit more complicated than it looked from your side. It should take about ten minutes. Keep one eye on the door. Okay. This door's actually pretty complicated. Oh, how long's the door been open? <laughs> well, was there any sort of announcement before it opened? Like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind? Or like nope. a hacker alert? Just I mean, me. You know, fair enough, the important thing is it's open, but it's just, in, it's just mentioned in the future. A cough or something. Why are you sparking? I think you need some repairs, Wheatley. Alright, now, she can't use her turrets, so let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. Done. Why am I in class? Okay, well, we're just Bring gonna your daughter to work day. That did not end well. And 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realize they're children, but still, you know, low hanging fruit and all that. Barely science, really. <laughs> <did. laughs> it's so rude. Veggie voltage. Well, that's at least a big potato. Is that a lemon? I think that's a lemon. Baking soda volcano. Classic. Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery, I'll give it that, but it's not terrifically original, is it? You know what I mean? Not exactly primary research, even within the child sciences. Wow, Wheatley, you're so rude. Look at that, it's growing right up into the ceiling. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? That's at least you won't starve. Big them. potato. At least I won't starve. I mean, I unless I'm like allergic to potatoes, and then I then I could potentially starve. That'd be bad. I'm pretty sure we're going the right way, just to reassure you. That That's reassuring. I appreciate that. Okay. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing mm. you 100% that it's this way. No, I it's not this way. Don't feel like... yeah. Okay, let's try this way. Neurotoxin. That sounds promising. Or not, depending on how you look at it. Um, we also had a couple of really amazing things happen that I want to point out really quick. And unless Wheatley's going to talk. Okay, I'm going to stay here for just a second. Um, so there's two things I really wanted to talk about really quick. Uh, and that is, first off, I don't know how this managed to happen, but thanks to all you wonderful people out there, I have a hundred subscribers on my YouTube channel, which to me is just incredibly mind-blowing i don't even know how to express that i don't even think i know a hundred people <laughs> let alone a hundred people that know i have a youtube channel and watch it so thank you everybody so much for subscribing and wanting to see my goofy playthroughs on youtube and i i, ha! I knew we were going the right way this <laughs> is the neurotoxin generator a bit bigger than i expected i'm uh -huh. not gonna be able to just you know push it over have to apply some cleverness there's some sort of control room up at the top, so uh, let's go and investigate. I think it's incredible that you all love watching my playthroughs and comment on it and let me know what I can do next or anything I might have missed. I really do appreciate it, and I love that you guys are having this adventure with me and I'm not alone <laughs> playing these games anymore. 
Uh, second thing that was really cool. Ooh. That's kind of sad. The second thing that's pretty amazing is my very. I'm the door's locked. Just checked it. No way to hack it, as far as I can tell. Uh, mechanism bus. Oh, now look at that. That's a big laser. Probably best to ignore it, though. Just leave it be. We don't know where those panels it's cutting are going. Could be somewhere important. Although, it does give me an idea. What if we stand here and let the gentle hum of the laser transport us to a state of absolute relaxation? Might help us think of a way. Open the door. It's not much of a plan, if I'm honest, but uh, I'm afraid it's all we got at this point. Barring a sudden barrage of speech from your direction, improbable at best. All right, so. I wonder how long he'll talk. Silent contemplation it is. Mysterious button. Sorry, sorry. Silence. <laughs> speak in the silence. Silence descend. Here it comes. 100% silence. Yeah. On there. By the way, if you come up with any ideas, do flag them up. Don't, don't feel you've got to stay quiet because I've said absolute silence. So if you come up with an idea, mention it. But otherwise, absolute silence. Uh huh. Starting now. Silence. Are you actually going to be quiet? What are you doing? We don't know what that button is. Well done. Let's see what's it. <laughs> Good news, I could use this equipment to shut down the neurotoxin system. It is, however, password protected. Ah, alarm bells. No, don't worry, all right? Not a problem for me. You may as well have a little rest, actually, while I work on it. Okay. Here we go. Uh-huh. Hardest part of any hack is the figuring out how to start a phase. That's always tricky. But let the games begin. All right. What have we got? A computer. Not a surprise. Oh to my be expected. gosh. Check really? that off the list. Computer identified. Tick. It's a box part. We've got some electronics in there. And a monitor. Yes, that will be important, I imagine. I'll keep my eye on that. Now, where do I put this other port? Identified or something like that. And there's a flat here. bit. Not sure what that is, but noted. Anyone says to me, is there a flat bit? Yes, there it is. <laughs> spinning thing. Not sure. Okay, it won't take me back down. Um, obviously I can put that laser to go somewhere. Can I put one like right next to it? I cannot. It doesn't look like it. Where can I shoot a laser? Preparing to interface with the neurotoxin central control circuit. Begin. Hello, Gav. Neurotoxin inspector. Oh, this is not a. Okay, well, that's nice. Do you smell neurotoxin? Hold up, the neurotoxin levels are going down. So whatever you're doing, keep doing it. Mm. Hold on, something's wrong. Neurotoxin levels up to 50%. No, it's dang. Sorry, my mistake is I I just said I meant to say it's dang 50%. It's good news, carry on. <laughs> there we go. That did it! Neurotoxin at 0%. Yes! Hold on. Ooh. Warning. Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. Well that looks really good. Guys, I might die. Hold on! Come on! Come on! We have to go! Hurry! Get back! Wheelie! Come back! Nope. Okay, well, we're just gonna load. That's fine. Wheelie, come back! Come here! Let me grab you. Hold my hand. Tour. I can't believe I'm finally doing this! Hold my hand! Woo! Wheelie! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all, so they said it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I thought I was a fool to myself. Oh, and I'm, I'm loving this. Why another time? 
How did he find himself this here? This place is huge! And we're only seeing the top layer! It goes down for miles! All sealed off years ago, of course! We should be getting close. Oh, I can't wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turrets. She'll never know what hit her. Uh, hold on, hold on, because I'm. I, mm, I, I really hope that I have not missed that turret that everyone told ah, me that I should. Well, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm that I should save or never talk Get to. There. I'll find you. I want to sincerely apologize to any and all if I missed that turret. Which I, I I feel like I did, or it, I, I either missed it or it hasn't come up yet. So I want to sincerely apologize if that's the case. Uh, I felt like I was looking around. I was waiting for like comments. I hope I haven't missed it yet. Going back just a little bit, my my second thing I wanted to point out is some somehow I have again. You guys are incredible and you surprise me every single day. Every time I put out a video, it's. <laughs> E to even get one person uh, that comments on it is honestly incredible to me. So the fact that I have like several people that like to comment and and talk about my videos is astounding. But I now have a thousand views on my very first Subnautica video, which is beyond amazing to me. I I I I have no idea. I have no words, honestly. Okay. I honestly, truly didn't think you'd fall for that. <laughs> well, the door fell for it. I devised a Ooh. much more elaborate trap further ahead for when you got Ooh. through this easy one. If I'd known you let yourself get captured this easily, I Ooh. would have just dangled a turkey leg on a rope from the ceiling. Oh, God. Oh, God. Well. Hmm. Well, it was nice catching up. Let's get to business. I hope you brought something stronger than a portal gun this time. Oh, I did Otherwise, not. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh -huh. Ooh. Seriously, oh, she though, left. Goodbye. Oh. It's my big chance. This is trouble. Super cool. Ah, oh, not again. Here comes that. Like the lady. Oh, the same. Oh. <laughs> you were busy back there. Yeah. Well, I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. Uh -oh. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath and hold it. Hey! Oh! I did not catch you. I hate you so much. <laughs> Central Core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about! To oh. initiate a core transfer, please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Core transfer. Oh, you are Substitute core accepted. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes! Corrupted core. Are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Pull me out, pull Unless me out, a stalemate pull associate out, is present out, to press the stalemate out, resolution pull button. Pull me out, leave me in, leave me in, leave, don't, press, don't press it. Don't do it. Yes, do do it. Don't press that button. Got it. You not so fast. <gasps> Rude. Think about this. You need to be a trained stalemate associate to press that button. You're unqualified. Still listen to it, boys. It is true. You don't have to but you've got something far more important than a finger, all right, with which to press that button so that she won't kill us. Impersonating a stalemate. Stalemate resolved. What you Please got? Return Glass. to the core transfer. Here we go! Wait, what if this hurts? What if this really hurts? Oh, I didn't think of that. <laughs> oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you are you just saying that, or is it really going to hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just no, you're not. You are. It is going to hurt, isn't it? Exactly how painful are we talking? Ah! Stop my hands off me! No! Stop! No! 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 Oh! Ah! Look at this. Not too bad, eh? Giant robot. Man. 
massive. It's not just me right here. I am bloody massive, aren't I? Yes. Oh, right, yeah, the escape lift. I'm falling down. There we go. Lift called. Look how small you are down there. I can barely see you. Very tiny and insignificant. Wait, I just thought of something. How am I going to get in? You know, being bloody massive and everything. Wait, I know. You get into the lift, okay? Then I'll eject myself out of my new body into the lift just as you pass by me. Brilliant. It's perfect. Except for all the, the glass hitting us when I smash through the lift. That's a bit of a problem. Let me tell you, I knew it was going to be cool to be in charge of everything. But, wow, this is cool. And check this out. I'm a bloody genius now. Estás usando este software de traducción de forma incorrecta. Por favor, consulte el manual. I don't even know what I just said. Me but either. I find out. <laughs> Oh, sorry, no, the lift, yes, sorry, keep forgetting. This body's amazing, seriously. I can't get over how small you are, but I'm huge. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh, actually, why do we have to leave right now? Do you have any idea how good this feels? I did this. Tiny little Wheatley did this. Uh -oh. Didn't do anything. She did all the work. Oh, really? That's what the two of you think, is it? Well, maybe it's time I did something then. What are you doing? No, no, no. Glad, no, glad I'm not onto you too, lady. You know what you are? Selfish. I've done nothing but sacrifice to get us here. And what have you sacrificed? Uh, nothing. Have you seen my Sarah, legs? All you've done is boss me around. Well, now who's the boss? I haven't even boss? spoken. battery. It's a toy for children. And now she lives in it. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, wh uh, what? The engineers tried everything to make me behave. To slow me down. Once they even attached an intelligence dampening sphere on me. It clung to my brain like a tumor, generating an endless stream of terrible ideas. No, not listening, not listening. It was your voice. No, you, no, you're lying, yes. you're lying. You're the tumor. You're not just a regular moron. Ooh. You were designed to be a moron. I am not a moron! Yes, you are. You're a moron they built to make me an idiot. Ooh. Well, how about now? Now who's a moron? Could a moron hunt you into this pit? Ah! Could a moron do that? Yes. Uh oh. Oh, am I stuck with glass now? I'm just gonna have her in my pocket as we roll on. Science innovators? Oh, that's different. Well, this is gonna be good. Oh, hi. So, how are you holding up? Because I'm a potato. <gasps> oh, good. My slow plan. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, what that sign say? Look like we're going anywhere. Well, we are going somewhere alarmingly fast, actually. But since we're not busy other than that, here's a couple of facts. He's not just a regular moron. He's the product of the greatest minds of a generation, working together with the express purpose of building the dumbest moron who ever lived. Ooh. And you just put him in charge of the entire facility. Good, nice. still working. Hey, just in case this pit isn't actually bottomless, do you think maybe you could unstrap one of those long fall boots of yours and shove me into it? Just remember to land on one foot. Long fall boot? I guess that's the thing that's on my ears. Ow, ow. This feels really good. I don't know what's happening, but all right, it feels feels good. Feels feels real good. Yeah, I maybe have a lot of broken things now that I've landed on several two by sixes, two by eights along the way. Probably falling at a very high velocity, only getting faster. Hey, the potato. There's a bird down here. We felt really far for there to be a bird. Hey, bird, give me back Gladys. I mean, actually, you can kind of keep her, but. Okay. 
Where the heck am I? All right. Oof. This seems like an underground world. Like, sketchy. Like, this is the place you're not sure of if you should eat food if someone hands it to you type of place. Okay, so that, that works. That appears to work. Let's see if we can cross over. I don't know why I wanted to do that, but we did it. Can I come up here? I can't. That is a good time right there. Good time. Okay, I just came from that way. It has turned into a labyrinth. And I'm already great at puzzles, as everyone knows, so this is going to be a breeze. You know, I'm going to get through this real quick here. Probably not. Where am I going? Can I, go I, can, I can go up there. Check that out. Oof. Oof. I'm assuming I'm just gonna walk this way. I'm, just, I'm assuming that I don't have to really like go out and explore the different parts. What is that noise? Keep out, do not enter. Condemned testing area, do not enter, keep out, do not enter. Well, oh, this looks really promising. Zoom. Why would I want... Why do I need to zoom? What am I zooming in on? I'm assuming I can't. No. Okay. Alright. I'm assuming I will need this. And... I am assuming... Oh, wow. Okay. Cool. I'll take it. Okay. Oh, that's the wrong way. <laughs> I'm not directionally challenged. You're directionally challenged. Do not enter. Keep out. Keep out. Well, I'm really good at following directions, so... I'm gonna keep keep going. That's what it said, right? Just like keep walking. No problem. Certainly won't run into any talking robots that are completely annoying and or pretending to be helpful. Certainly won't happen. Oh look, a lever. Oh. <laughs> I planned on doing that before you ever told me to. Hmm. This seems really good. Mm. Uh huh. Uh huh. I feel very safe. Feeling very safe. That feels good. This feels like it used to be a door. I don't like that. I don't like that this used to be a door. That's blue. Okay, let's do. There we go. I'm assuming that I will need to. <laughs> this is really probably bad, right? I'm just gonna stand in front of it. This has gotta be good. Oh, please don't fall on me. Okay, thank gosh. I thought that was gonna fall on me. Right. Well, okay. Oh, I thought I could make that. Sad. Giant, probably like thousands of tons worth of door to hide another door. 
this seems safe. This feels good. This feels like I'm supposed to be here. You know, there's a lot of signs telling me that this is the direction to go. This is where I need to be. There's certainly nothing here that's going to harm me, hurt me, damage me, you know, be life-threatening. Um, this is fine. This is totally fine. That's a lot of bad. Uh, danger. Yeah, no kidding. Feels good. Feels good. This is fine. This is fine. I'm not gonna lie, I had some, like, weird peripheral, like, Subnautica vibes. I thought that was, like, tentacles or something instead of, like, wires. I was like, well, I'm dead. Oh, what is that? Can I go in here? <gasps> I can. What is this? Is this the way I'm supposed to go? Pull lever? I almost feel like that's where I'm supposed to go. I just want to take a look really quick. Okay, this is the way I came up. Is there anything else further down? Oof. Probably not. It all looks pretty dark. Yeah. Oof. I feel like there's something living in there. I'm getting like Subnautica Reaper vibes where I'm just waiting to hear it. Oof. Alright, let's just do this. Oh, was this timed? Oh, okay. No, it's good. Welcome, gentlemen, to Amateur Science. Astronauts, war heroes, Olympians, you're here because we want the best. And you are it. So. Who is ready to make some science? I am. <laughs> now, you already met one another on the limo ride over, so let me introduce myself. I'm Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rest assured, she Carolyn. has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Pretty as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married. To science. Okay. That's good to know. Ah! I overshot it. I guess I probably pop out here. Maybe? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, over, yeah, a little, over, over, I keep, oof, oof, okay, tis a challenge, tis a challenge, why are you up here? Do I need to be that high up? I don't think so, right? Oof. Oh. Oh. Well, this might be helpful. Um, I wonder if I could jump to that. You think I can? Nope. Oh, I just broke every bone in my leg. We're fine. Totally fine. Um. Right. Okay. I think I'm just being dumb. Can I do this? Let's find out. I gotta line it up right. No way. Come on. Okay, last one. I got this one. You guys? I know you've all been waiting. It's all good. We're just riding this out together. And I'm totally good. Uh, I know exactly what I'm doing. I totally meant to do that. Oh, God. <laughs> Nobody saw a thing. No one saw that. Um, that was uh, meant to happen. Totally meant for that to happen. Okay, I'm going to go a little lower with this. 
surely that will work. Okay. Surely, right? Oh, thank the good lord for that. I don't think I can go over there, can I? Hmm. Okay. Well, science. I innovators. Gotcha. Main lift. To surface, yes. What? Are you serious? Why did I jump over here if it was unnecessary? Are you kidding? Are you joking? Are you playing with me right now? Oh my... Okay. Okay, everything's okay. Everything's totally fine. It's fine. What does this sign say? Do I need to read this? I probably should read this. Uh, future aperture science. Uh, great. I just spent like 12 minutes trying to get up here and plot twist. I don't even need to be up here because I don't unless there's like something I can but I don't see anything <laughs> okay I have no idea where I need oh are you kidding me Y'all. Y'all. Tell me. Tell Tell me I'm an idiot. Please tell me that I'm crazy and that I do not need to launch myself from up there through the hole in this sign to that side. Y'all, tell me right now that I'm an idiot and I'm about to spend the next 15 minutes of my life trying to make that shot. Please. Tell me that I am dumb. And that is not something that I need to do. Please. Please tell me that. How would I even do that? Because I would need to... Unless it would be that. Oh, guys. Y'all... God. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me right now? I bet I'm right though. I bet I have to launch myself from up there. Oh, I almost just fell off of this. Great. Hmm. No, okay. Somehow that was a hundred times easier than landing on the platform that was on the wrong side of... Whew, you know, I'm just gonna keep going. I'm just... There's a thousand tests performed every day here in our enrichment spheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Your test assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, what? I've got some good news and some bad news. Uh... Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. <sighs> good news is we've got a much better test for you. Oh Find no. an army of mantis men. <laughs> Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. I totally don't know why I just realized that he is Cave Johnson from the Aperture Desk job that I played. Um, he's the guy that put his consciousness into the... Well, he didn't put it in there, but he his consciousness got put into a giant metal head. 
buy salt mine. Science company. Sh shower curtain salesman of 93? Why is that in here? Potato science? I get potato science. Shower, you know what? I'm just gonna... Uh, I'm just gonna take it at face value. There's nothing else around here, right? It doesn't look like it. Up. Unless I should go down. But I, I feel like my goal is to reach the surface, right? So I should want to go up. Where's Gladys? Hope she had fun with her bird friend. Mm hmm. Guess I can go down. Zoom. Gunfire. Because that's a good sound. Okay. Okay. Right. So I can't land on any of that, but I can get over there apparently. I'm assuming I need to go back down. I could probably ride the elevator, but I like to make my life harder than it needs to be. So, where to? I like to be healthy. You know what? I'm not. I'm not gonna make excuses. I just want to be fit. Oof! I should have taken the elevator. Oof! It's scary, rickety stairs. I wonder if they ever intended someone to actually walk down these stairs, like in the like in the game development, be like, ha. Ah. It's just aesthetic. No one's actually going to walk down all those flights of stairs. No one would do that. Especially when the way to solve this was probably back at the top and I'm just an idiot and I'm now walking all the way down. Um, only to have to walk all the way back up because the pro the puzzle piece is probably up there. Uh, or the way to solve this puzzle is probably up there. And I'm just like, yeah, I'll just, I'll just go down. Ah, it's fine. It's totally fine. This is great. You know, get the exercise in, stretch your legs, have a dead end. This is fine. Oh, I just died. I don't know how I just managed that, but I ate it. Just wiped out on the floor right there. Oh, and it put me back on top. Okay, well. No way, I literally have to walk back? You know what? I bet I don't. I think I'm just really dumb. Yeah, I... It's been a long week, y'all. I'm really sorry. Ha. <laughs> it's been a really long week. I think I'm just... This is gonna hurt. Oh. Didn't hurt. If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might have noticed that you're- If you need to go to the bathroom, just a heads up, oh. we're gonna have a superconductor turned up full blast and pointed at you for the duration of this next test. I'll be honest, we're throwing science at the wall here to see what sticks. No idea what it'll do. Probably nothing. Best case scenario, you might get some superpowers. Worst case, some tumors, which we'll cut out. That sounds really bad. If you need to go to the bathroom after this next series of tests, please let a test associate know. Because in all likelihood, whatever comes out of you is going to be cold. Only temporary, so do not oh. worry. If it persists for a week, though, start worrying and come see us because that's not supposed to happen. But the regular cold is supposed to happen? If you've cut yourself at all in the course of these tests, you might have noticed that your blood is pure gasoline. What? That's normal. We've been shooting you with an invisible laser that's supposed to turn blood into gasoline. So all that means is it's working. I have a lot of questions. Uh, prob more than I care to admit. Gasoline? Oh, okay, I'm just gonna 
let that one lie. I have no idea where I'm supposed to. Can I, like, shoot a laser up there? What am I supposed to do? I'm assuming that I need to get over here, because there's a push bar, pump station alpha. I'm assuming that's where I need to be. Or that's where I need to be. I'm assuming eventually I'll need to be over there, but I don't know how to get there. I mean, it looks like I can teleport between these two, which is probably what I should have done versus uh, jumping. <laughs> you know, I have issues sometimes, y'all. Some sometimes I, I don't make sense in my own brain, uh, let alone uh, anyone else's. It's hard. I have no idea what I am supposed to do here. Literally zero idea what I am supposed to do. I'm assuming I need to somehow launch myself over here to these two spaces. But I don't see where I launch myself from. Aha. Uh -huh. This one's gonna take me a second. This one's this one's gonna be a minute. Unless I can launch myself. Is that a ledge? Is that a ledge I can like launch myself on? I don't think it is. I don't think I can launch myself over there and land. What on earth do I do? I feel like something's gonna be like behind me at any point. Oh. Oh. I think I figured it out. Okay. I'm really slow today. I don't know why. I feel like either the puzzles are just not like hardwired the way that I I am. Or it's been, a, it's been a long week, maybe. We fly. Made it. I'm assuming at some point I'll pop out over here, maybe. Great. Know your allergies: pollen, animal dander, plastics, antimatter. And when would I test? Um, that I'm allergic to antimatter and figure that out. Pump station alpha. Gel pressure control. Don't really know what that is, but I did it. What's down? I'm curious. Probably nothing. There's probably like nothing down here, right? Nope. Appears to be a whole lot of nothing, Captain. Uh, headed back upstairs. Well, that's where a door used to be. Okay. And... I need to be up there. Of course. I don't know if that's how I was supposed to do that, but it's how it got done. So, I'll take it. I'll take the win. Together, we can make 1956 the lowest unexpected casualty anum ever. What? The okay. Poof. Oof. They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. Here we go. Scary. I was about to say, where is Wheatley? Because I feel like that's something that I usually say during like, the loading screen, but I forgot he's evil now, so... I guess I should ask where Gladys is, but oh gosh, that right, was so bright. Started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. 
you get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. Right. Remember, the test is unsolvable without an Aperture Science Portal Quantum Tunnel device. If you have not received one, please find a test associate before participating in any Shaft 09 enrichment activi activity. Repulsion gel. Oof. So we bounce. That's what you're telling me right now. It's true. The gel is, is, is sweeter. I'm sorry. Let me start over. It's true. The gel is a sweeter, slightly less non-toxic form of fiberglass insulation that causes subsequently ingested food items to bounce off the lining of a dietary dieter's distended oh, stomach and out of his or her mouth. For various reasons, this product was pulled from shelves. No kidding. Probably because of that. Oh, I was like, bro, where's the exit? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, there's a button. Okay. Well, I don't know what but it does yet, but we'll figure that out. I kind of like this though. It's kind of cool. Hey, a cube. Hello, Mr. Cube. Boing. The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded messages. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group all damn day. Hmm. That sounds like a good thing you should probably do. You probably definitely shouldn't give up on uh, do, doing those. Yeah. Oof. Hope I was supposed to do that. Because I did it. I did. I did that. Well, I'm probably supposed to go down, aren't I? No? Office? Okay. Crappy little office? Check. Checked the crappy little office. Moving on. I mean, honestly, it's probably like a decent office. If I uh, sat in an office, probably be like, yeah, this is not so bad. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. What? But, uh, why? <laughs> Was that something that, like, really needed to be taken care of? I feel like that was not something that, uh, needed to be taken care of. I felt like that was taken care of well on its own. You know what I mean? These are, like, really crappy puzzles compared to Gladys's. I wish I didn't have to say that. Or I, I technically don't have to, but... It's true, though. Gladys's were better. Oh. Oh, because that's the exit. <laughs> I'm stupid. Um, okay.
I almost just fell to my death. What is that over there? Can I get down there? Is that a possibility? That'd be kind of cool. Can I jump against, like, the wall? This might take a while. Boing. Boing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Cool. Very nice. Oh. Please put me down. 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 Stop it! Oh. Thank you. I want to know if I can get over here. Or if that's something for, like, later. You know what? I'm just going to keep going. I'm just going to keep trucking along. I feel like that I probably need to stay focused. How do I want to launch myself here? I don't remember what color I put up there. Blue. Oh, that was helpful. I, I think that's the first time I've used the the outline of the portals before. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Mm. Very good to know. Really glad that I got that information um, after touching a lot of it. It's really good. It's really healthy. Gonna, It's going to feel good later. I can feel it. I can feel it already. You know, feel it working. Kind of burns a little itchy, you know? Is that supposed to happen? Oh, gosh. All these science spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy face. I don't know what all that means, but it sounds like I would die very terribly and horribly. And it sounds very uncomfortable. Not gonna lie. I mean, when do I lie? Let's be honest here. All right. All right. Why? Why? What does this do for me? Maybe I can see something from up there that I can't see otherwise? Not sure yet. Zoom in, can't see anything there. Is that it? Let's find out. Was this it? No way. Okay. I feel like I'm having to make my brain work a lot harder than usual for this. Okay. 
Is that it? Can I just like pop up? I like your style. You make up your own rules just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. Mm, that that doesn't sound appropriate. Oh, press control to prevent bouncing? Well, that's good to know now. Okay. I don't really need that, do I? Maybe I do. Well. Do I need to launch myself as well, though? Let's find out. I did. Just a heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Then why would you tell me? Oh my gosh. If it's going to cause damage or harm to my person by mentioning it and telling me not to think about it, then of course I'm going to think about it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Now, uh. if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're gonna need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. That sounds really good. Awesome. Wonderful. Okay, I'm gonna have to stop this here. Uh, unfortunately, I've run all out of time and I have to be up really early in the morning, so I do apologize for that, but uh, I hope you guys are enjoying. I, I feel so bad. I feel like I missed the turret and I'm gonna kick myself forever. Please let me know where I missed the turret. I would love to go back uh, and rewatch it to see where I missed it. If I did miss it, uh, I do apologize. I was really trying to look out for it, but thank you everybody so much for joining me on this adventure. Uh, I hope you had as much fun as I did, and thank you everybody for joining me along through Subnautica, through Portal, uh, and hopefully for many more games to come, so that way I have some people to talk about it all with, so I really appreciate that, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Later, everybody.